today i will discuss the zeeman effect what is zeeman effect first of all i will discuss the effect of splitting of spectral line into two or more components of slightly different frequency when the source is placed in the weak constant magnetic field this zeeman effect was first observed in 1896 by the dutch physicist peter zeeman by as broadening of yellow d1 lines of sodium atom he got nobel prize for physics in 1902 jointly with his former teacher hendrik anton lorentz before discussing the zeeman effect i will discuss some basics about the quantum mechanics first of all we will discuss the quantum numbers we know that quantum numbers are the numbers which describe the complete information of electron inside the atom first quantum number is principal quantum number it is represented by n and the values for n are 1 2 3 and so on and these numbers describe the number of shells present in the atom second quantum number is orbital angular momentum quantum number and it is written by l and the value of l are 0 to n minus 1 and it represent the number of sub shells present in the shell and they are denoted by s p d f and so on and third quantum number is magnetic quantum number which represent the energy shift and it is written by ml and the values for magnetic quantum numbers are minus l2 plus l similarly the fourth one is spin quantum number and this quantum number is noted by plus minus half and value for this quantum number only uh, two values that is plus minus half and fifth one is the total quantum number that is written by j and the values for j varying from l minus s to l plus s after that we will discuss spectral lines we know that spectral lines are the lines which are produced by the transition of electrons from higher energy level to lower energy level and these spectral lines can be noted by n 2s plus 1 l j where 2s plus 1 is called multiplicity and l is orbital quantum number and j is total quantum number for more than one electron atoms the value of total angular momentum l is the summation of l quantum numbers and these are represented by s p d f similarly the total spin quantum number is described by the total spin angular momentum and similarly total angular momentum that is j can be obtained by summation of all j values and corresponding eigen values for l s and j can be noted by h cross l into l plus 1 under root similarly h cross s into s plus 1 under root and h cross j and j plus 1 under root respectively zeeman effect is classified in two categories first one is normal zeeman effect and second one is anomalous zeeman effect first normal zeeman effect in this effect the s value is zero and l and j values are equal but they are not non they are not zero they are not zero values so in this case spectral line split in three components the components with delta m is equal to zero are called pi lines and components with delta m <coughs> is equal to minus 1 and plus 1 are called sigma lines and there are two possibilities first possibility is that when magnetic field is parallel to the line of sight and second possibility when magnetic field is perpendicular to the line of sight so in first case two sigma circular polar lines are obtained and in the second case two sigma polarized vertical lines and one pi polarized horizontal line is obtained these line can be seen in this slide in first case there is no magnetic field only single line is there and when magnetic field is applied to the spectral line then three lines are formed first line having a frequency nu not plus delta nu 
second line nu naught and third one is nu naught minus delta nu where delta nu is called Zeeman shift. The normal Zeeman effect transitions are represented by this diagram. There are selection rules for m values delta m is equal to 0 and plus minus 1. So in this case one line in which delta m is equal to minus 1 and second line in which delta m is equal to 0 and third line in which delta ml is equal to plus 1. And these lines are shown in this diagram. There are three transitions first, second and third one. And these are also represented in vertical bar beam, bar like uh, graph. The number of splitting levels in the magnetic field are 2L plus 1. So this is the transitions of electrons and production of spectral lines. And we, we, we see in this slide, there are five total values for L equal to and there are three spectral lines for L is equal to 1. And in the first case, then delta M is equal to plus 1. That is transition from 0 to 1 level, minus 1 to 0 level and minus 2 to minus 1 level. Similarly, plus 1 to 1 level and 0 to 0 level and third one is minus 1 to minus 1 level. Similarly, 2 to plus 1 level, 1 to 0 level and 0 to minus 1 level. So these three spectral lines are seen in this diagram. Similarly, the second effect is normal, uh, anomalous Zeeman effect. In this effect, both S values and L values are non-zero values, just like this. In this case, total J value and mu J, these are not anti-parallel. In this case, G is also not equal to 1. So delta E is equal to G delta MJ and mu J and B. So G factor is also called Lenz G factor and it is noted by G is equal to 1 plus J J plus 1 plus S into S plus 1 minus L into L plus 1 over 2 J into J plus 1. So for S states that is L is equal to 0 this G value is 2 and for singular state G is equal to L and G value is 1. So in this effect we can uh, write the overall change in energy that is splitting energy is gj mu b bz and mj values the anomalous zeeman effect spectra is shown in this diagram there are two types of uh, lines for sodium atom first lines are called d1 lines and second lines are called d2 lines in first lines there are total four lines sub lines and in d2 lines there are total six lines so in first case the transition is uh, due to p half state to s half state and in d2 lines there is transition of electron from p 3 by 2 state to s 1 by 2 state. So the anomalous dim effect lines are given in this diagram for simplicity d1 there are 4 lines in d2 case there are 6 lines. So it is without magnetic field d1 d2 and with magnetic field these are the 4 and 6 lines. So this is all about Zeeman effect. Thank you very much.